Hello, this is Paula and today we're going to discuss about what are proteins. Proteins are organic molecules containing carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, nitrogen, and many times sulfur. Why do we need proteins? Proteins are essential to all living cells and include the enzymes, hormones, and antibodies needed to keep organisms healthy and functioning properly. They are, import they are important because our tissues uses them for a structure, function, growth, re 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 <laughs> Regulation, like for the blood, and repair. Um, where can we find proteins? Proteins can be found in something we all love, in food, like nuts and meat, in eggs, in milk, and fish. Uh, proteins are made up of small molecule containing an animal group, or NH2, and a carboxylic COOH group. So now let's talk about animal acids. Okay. The general structure of animal acids is RCHNH2COOH. They make up proteins and are the building blocks of enzymes, hormones, proteins, and body tissue. So now here, here we have a how kind of the, um, the amino acids look like. You see here is the amino group. This one is a carboxylic group. And this is the side chain. Peptide bond and linkage. A peptide bond is a covalent bond formed between two molecules where a carboxyl group form, from one molecule reacts with an amine group of another group molecule. When this happens, a molecule of water, or H2O, is released. The four atom functional group, C, O, and H, is called a peptide link. So now we're going to have another example of how it looks like. And here it is. Here you see this is the, this is the uh, pepti peptide bond. You see here we have the amino group. Here we have the carboxyl group. They are being connected here together. And here is the peptide bond where a water, and here's where the water molecule is being released. And this is the peptide link. You see here is the... C, uh, C O N H thing I just talked about, yeah. Peptide bond form compound form, peptide bond forms compounds of different sizes. A simple peptide bond, a simple peptide bond, uh, is the first one. It is a compound made of uh, made up of two or more amino acids. Oligopeptide has 10 or, 10 or less amino acids. And polypeptides have 10 and above amino acids. Organic proteins serve different biological functions in organisms like, like offering a structural strength, example, the cra crabs, you know, they have shells, that's their structural strength. They also have Transportation, like example, our blood. Our blood is being transported because of this. Messengers, they act as blue print for cell and, and, and organ development. So that's example DNA, which we're going to talk about later. And they speed up metabolic reaction. Yeah. Now we're going to talk about Nucleic acids. 
nucleic acids. Okay, so nucleic acids include a group of large complex organic acids. They are found they are found in all living cells and viruses, and they are like practically everywhere. And so what are they made of? They have nitrogenous het heterolic base. They have perto pentose sugar and and they have phosphate group. Nucleases are single-stranded and are double-stranded. So the single-stranded, single. -stranded, single -stranded